When everyone folds your forge to holes You're placing your bed Showing no regret Close your eyes to hide your lies Roll the dice You got me tiptoeing around you like you made of glass Got an invincible thing Talking rude. You're playing a game, driving me insane. Your heart is back, and it's a fact, no turning back. You got me tiptoeing around you like you made a glass. I was putting on my makeup, Iris. How's everyone doing? Cad, Clive, Billy, Iris. Am I missing anybody? If I miss you, I'm sorry. Oh yeah, I guess I could swap screens, huh? Which one you want? You want this one? So you can see my makeup? I don't have my lights on, and you'll see why in a minute. How's everyone doing? I don't know why I bounce around. What's going on, Jacob? Hey, how's that uh, pink Freightliner treating you, Jacob? She's a beauty. I kind of like the red light. Doesn't make me look as ugly. Y'all ready for this? Let me know if you're ready. I have something to show you. Oh, you mean you heard? You haven't watched it yet? What the hell? I think I did add LCD screens. It has the new dash, if that's what you mean. I mean, at least I bought you the newest model. Hey, honey, how you doing? Over there in the next room, doing your homework. Yeah, there will be a, <laughs> yeah, yes, um, management does not like the camera. She prefers seeing all of the screen. Plus, it's not a very flattering view of my, you know, and the sweatshirt makes me look like I've got a big old ear belly. There we go. Are you wearing slippers, Ty? I'm actually wearing Amazon Crocs. Is that a default SES truck? Uh, yeah. As a matter of fact, it is. Oh, hey, look at that. The chat's working up there on the, on the screen. Although I don't know why it isn't um, keeping more Messages. Oh, they have to come through faster, I guess. Well, it's nice I got that shit figured out. And I, I'm guessing the faster people type, the further up the screen it goes because 
in OBS I have that box going all the way up to the bottom of the camera. Thank you, Clive. It, I have, don't get me wrong, I'm blessed, I'm fortunate to have this. And first and foremost, for those of you that haven't heard this speech, what you're seeing right here, other than this Go XLR Mini over here that you probably can't see, but it's right down here, and this microphone that I'm talking on, and the webcam that's on the top of my monitor were the only things that were bought because of YouTube. Everything else here, I was doing prior to YouTube. Just because I'm ridiculous like that, I guess. I got this wild hair, we had this spare room. I'm like, hey, what if I moved my desk out of here and we bought this rig and anyway I have mixed feelings about it because see the keyboards over here to the left and then on this keyboard tray because why not have two of them you know another hundred bucks for another keyboard tray I have my Razer Tartarus V2 that has all my nice little buttons for farm sim when I play it um oh I take that back I stream deck was for uh, YouTube as well um but honestly this rig is like a single purpose right so if you're not doing a driving game or racing game it's kind of worthless because if you play games on mouse and keyboard first person shooters whatever that you can't really do that in this rig and then but over here on the wall which I don't know if you guys can see in the camera well there you can um, I have my controllers hung up and then I have a cord right here that I can plug in my controller so I can sit here and play games on a controller and for those interested um, I did a room tour it's on the channel. You have to scroll down a bit. I think it was like my third video ever. So it's not the greatest. I probably need to redo it because I've had some changes. Like I don't use my 40 inch super ultra wide as my main monitor anymore. That's on top of this one you see here. And then I have a third monitor. I can't even reach the camera anymore. It's so far away. But I have a third monitor right here that you guys are on. Your engine's getting cold, sorry. I have to talk to chat, jeez. Freaking pushy, man. Oh, it's daytime. It was nighttime about two minutes ago. How is it daytime? Hey, uh, so since the last stream, uh, there may have been an upgrade. Yes, exactly. Chris, what Iris said, put a blanket over it. Well, if your engine's getting cold, where... Okay, camera. Where are you? I mean, I know we have a big facility here now, but I don't see you. Hello, everybody. I'm right um, to, the right, to the right side of you, but I don't know why, why we can see each other. Because this game engine is fantastic. Yeah, yeah. another cool feature. I guess I need to pick a load, huh? I get sidetracked talking yeah. to chat. There's supposed to, there's been more messages. Like, I can't, this whole night bot, stream bot, cloud bot bullshit. Um, I spent the time and set the stuff up. Like, there should be reminder messages that pop in every now and then. Like, if you're enjoying the stream, you know, give it a like. Or if you're new here, subscribe, that sort of thing. I haven't seen one of those yet. 
me and bots, man, I tell you. Oh, job market. Cargo. I'm pretty sure. Hold on. I am pretty sure I have a reefer. Yes. Okay. And you have a reefer as well, right? Yeah. If you want to earn more money, you can check on this external market. There should be bigger prices. Oh, yeah. Good call. Why do I always exit out of that instead of just hitting the menu on the bottom? Yeah, I do the same <laughs> every time. Thank you, Iris. I appreciate that. Oh, we have, uh, we've got one load. Literally one load on the external market. <laughs> it's, uh, picking up at Pro Sped, going to Stokes in Vienna, Austria. Yeah, your, your camera is covering in the destination. So. Oh, yeah. See, that's the other thing about like this. If you work for this camera stuff. I don't know. I'll leave it there. Hello. Anyway. I don't know if I can call you Nectai Sugar Mama. But hello, anyway. She answers to pretty much anything. Management. Oh, yeah. Management. Yeah. I welcome to the management. Salute to the management. Um, so do we want to go to Austria? Okay, hold on. Let me check the cargo market to see if there's any. Oh, I will go. <clears throat> I will go whenever, wherever you want to go. Frankfurt. That's a haul. Twenty-seven thousand euro. Oh, that's a haul too. Hi, Kyoshi. Is that how you pronounce that, Kyoshi? Thank you. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> That's how I pronounce it, which is probably wrong. But I feel like there's probably some more flair to it, but he's probably used to getting it spelled or pronounced wrong. If I would say you, if I have to had to say this, uh, I would say Kiyoshi Numajiri. Right. <laughs> it's probably wrong. We are synchronizing with World of Trucks. Yeah, yeah, I can pick your load. Oh, so now you can pick it straight from there since we have the same trailer? Yes. Nice. Fire up this bad V8. You know, one thing I don't like about this uh, webcam is that in order to have a decent view I have to have my main light on in the office and I hate it uh, by the way do you want me to go first yeah sure that's fine I still don't even see you if you're moving yeah I need to leave the gate Oh, there it, it popped you in just as you were crossing the, oh, brakes time, okay. I don't want that view, thank you. So how's everyone's weekend going? Turn right. Went with a Thrustmaster T-818 in the end. Oh, yeah, um, Cad, actually, I just watched, uh, dang, what's that guy's name? After 100 yards, turn right. Turn right. Green Arrow. I can't think of the guy's name now, but he's obviously on. Hey, here we go. Let's try and read chat and uh, already bash our brand new trailer into a guard wall or guardrail. 
by the way green arrow means you can turn right but you have to stop and look if nothing is coming from the left yeah i did but i cut the corner too short why is um i'm trying to think of this guy's name on youtube now Anyway, Cad, he does sim racing simulation reviews, and he just posted the TA T818 review. Go straight. Okay, Streamlabs. I could have swore I turned all of that crap off. This body's masterpiece. See, this is what I hate all about all this bot crap. Like, I specifically turned everything off. Like, the emoji thing, all of that crap, and now it just completely erased Cad's message as I was After trying to read it because it was apparently too right. long. Turn right. After 50 yards, turn right. I mean, I could, I guess, alt-tab out of the game. What I really need to do is... I'm not at that level yet, though. You have reached your destination. I really just need to give someone access to all that shit to manage it. Could just skip loading. I really want to alt tab out and figure this stream stream lad bot thing out, but I'm afraid if I alt tab out something bad's gonna happen, so I'm not going to. truck just did but you must have got loaded yeah I got loaded so yeah. I'm guessing my trailer disappeared no I just kind of like flashed need to sell at least one old steering wheel that must be rough All yours, sir. Yeah, I would imagine not having four wheels. Are they... Don't tell me they're all direct drive. I would assume, though, seeing what your computer setups are on... Uh, where did I see that that you posted? Was that on Pizter's Discord? I would imagine you're not rocking it like a G920 or something like that. Not that there's anything wrong with G920s, but... Okay. Well, okay, so you may have four steering wheels, but, you, I mean, two are an upgrade, right? So it's not...
I think that you can, with four wheels, you can do a, like a land party or something like that. Yeah, right, Cad. They just need to kind of go up on a shelf like a trophy. Just kind of set up there and... You know, and as a and as a reminder of where you've come from, right? You started out small and now you've upgraded. Are we ready? We are. Wow, Iris, your brother gave you his direct drive. He wanted to upgrade. That's a nice brother. How can you upgrade direct drive? So he bought he bought a truck or something like that. No, you car? can get a um, so like mine is a r9 which means nine newton meters of torque and depending on what brand you go with i think they have some that are like after 100 yards some direct left. drive bases are um thousands of dollars if you're one of the uh serious types yeah okay so better direct drive uh, anyway, remember to uh, turn your lights on. Oh. Lights have to be on in convoy? No, in Europe. <laughs> oh, in Europe. Okay, got it. Well, I don't know if in the whole Europe, but uh, for sure in Poland you have to drive all, all day with lights on. Or Dang. at least with uh, day, daylight. 20 newton meters. They, they running straight. lights? I don't know how you say this. Yeah, daytime running lights. So if your truck has daytime running lights, you don't need your lights on, or do you still have to have them on because of trailer lights, I would imagine? I don't know about the truck, but in four-wheelers, you, you have to either have daytime running lights or, or normal lights on. Okay, Iris, well, now I'm curious that you don't know much about it, to be honest. What kind of wheel is it? Go straight. I just thought of it, Cad. Sim Racing Garage is the YouTube channel. <laughs> That's how my brain works. It's random. I would have probably messaged you on Discord had I thought about that in about five hours, too. Round. <laughs> oh. I think I lost you. Do, you. do you want me to wait for you? Mason, what's going on? No, I'm good. I have a GPS. I see you up there on the map. I got stopped by a red light. It says Fanatec. Okay. Still, After very nice gift from your brother. Turn right. Turn right. I am going slow so you can catch me up. Oh, it's all good, Mason. You haven't missed much. Keep right. After oh. 50 yards, exit right ahead. Of course I need to keep right when I get in the left lane. Hey, look, I see you. Exit right ahead. I need to be careful because I uh, lowered quite a bit all these track settings, like um, like suspension stiffness and and everything else. Yeah, did you see? Oh, wait. No, you haven't yet. Hey, by the way, folks, I'm going to promote a video. It even has a new thumbnail because everybody in the Discord voted I needed new thumbnails. Um, episode 97 that drops at 3 o'clock today, Central Standard Time. 
So basically an hour and a half. Is that right? No. The hell time is not 1.30? Yeah, hour and a half. Uh, is basically a Pizter modding showcase. And what made me think of that was Chris was talking about the stability. And I don't know what it is with that truck, but I didn't change the stability. But holy buckets, that thing is squirrely. You're right, right behind me, right? Yeah. Well, there's about three cars between us, but yes. Okay, I'm speeding up to 85. We have entered the Czech Republic. Yeah, we can stop for a beer and uh, they have this national dish called Nadlichki, very good. It doesn't sound very appetizing, but I'll take your word for it. Why? Knedlitski? It's delicious. You can ask Jacob. We get a special episode when you hit a hundred episodes. Um, well, Gee, no pressure there, huh, Iris? Uh, I mean, if if you're talking like a hundred episodes on YouTube, I've already passed that, so um, you're good to come over if you want, because that car left. Jacob said he has no idea what you're talking about. He's lying as usual. The, uh, okay, Iris, so the special, when I hit 100 episodes, I'm actually going to be recording episode 100 tomorrow, because 97 comes out today. I edited and uploaded 98 this morning. I'll record 99 this evening. I don't know what I could do special maybe not run into a barrier <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, <laughs> this is good <laughs> not miss a shift <laughs> special for 100 perfect uh, right i actually thought about and honestly i did think about as i was c recording i'm like damn it i should have done this pister truck and trailer at episode 100 uh, by that, but the wheels were already in motion, and uh, I didn't. By the way, we spent this whole time, actually you did, uh, to set the camera properly, <laughs> and you are not using uh, shift, shift, shifter. No, my hand's on it. I'm using it. I'm in an automatic. Why they are going so slow? What's what is going on? It's AI traffic. Yeah, of course, switching lanes is impossible in this game. One of these days, without, I'll without probably without your accident. I can't remember what engine it is. Was that a mod, though? I think. The short amount of time I played ETS on my main profile. Um, I'm trying to remember how many speeds right. it has. After 50 yards, turn right. Really, car? How about you get going? Because I need to get over. Oh, thanks, truck, for slowing down. Turn right. Anyway, where was I at? The. Uh... Keep right. After 50 Damn it! Yards, I missed right. the exit. Oh, that was you. Okay. Well, at least it wasn't me this time. Um, this GPS is non-readable. Non the uh, 
Keep right. After 50 yards, turn right. Train of thought, Ty. There was a transmission I found that was basically right. a standard American H pattern, basically. It wasn't an 18 speed. I can't remember what it was. Oh, that was, that's good, Iris. <laughs> she said I can fill my 100th video with uh, moments that went well instead of all the mistakes. That'd be a short video, number one. Keep left. <laughs> number two, I ain't got that kind of time to sit and go through all the old videos and pull clips. How about bloopers and outtakes? Basically what I'm saying is I'm a shitty YouTuber. Now, honestly, I mean, if I wasn't putting out a video a day, I could probably do something like that, but... Yes, exactly, Mason. <laughs> it probably would be a five-minute video. Why is this European traffic so nutty? I don't know. I feel like in real life, when that one truck is passing by another truck with one kilometer per hour difference. That damn white car went in the right lane, so I got in the left, and then it literally cut me off. Which is not unlike real life, but still. Thanks, Iris. There are many a day that I don't think I'm doing well. But I'm just doing my thing, and if people like it, great. What is going on here? That's a good question. So there's a guy with the... Uh, Oversized load. Truck. Yeah, but... <laughs> 40, 40 kilometers per hour. Hey Mason, I appreciate that. She is doing better. Admittedly. I've been a bad son. I haven't talked to her in a couple of days, but the last time I did talk to her, she was feeling better. And that's kind of how our uh, our family operates is like the no news is good news sort of thing. Jeez. But yes, she is doing better. Thank you for asking. Okay. Jacob said it's the same engine. What engine? Game engine? Yeah. Do you think it's a traffic mod we're running? It may be. I mean, I'm, but the thing is, we're, I'm running the same mod in ATS. Yeah, and but in, a, in ATS you play single player. Oh. So, and here, I, we talked about this, I think, because there are two of us, uh, so two traffic mods, and I don't know if they work together or just double traffic oh yeah the other I mean I guess I it, the traffic part wouldn't bother me it's the whole change in lanes every two seconds that they do and then well this is another cool uh, SCS feature uh, Chris Jacob said you should blink the lights like a pro BMW driver when someone is blocking your way I can turn on my disco lights. <laughs> yes. 
Yeah, of course, someone... Oh my god. Guess what we're gonna do for tomorrow as an experiment for science. You asking me? Yeah. I don't know. We're we're gonna be taking out the uh, left. traffic mod <laughs> after after today. Yeah, sure. Empty streets, but okay. Well, we'll see how it works. I mean, it may be. Um, then we'll at least know, right? Yeah, yeah, sure, no problem. Keep left. Love the Z-Mod sound for the DAF XF-105. I'm running the Z-Mod V8 for the Scania. I'm just a big fan of Z mods, quite honestly. That was funny. Your truck leaned so far when you made that corner. <laughs> yeah, I have very low settings for truck stability, trailer stability, and everything else. Okay, I just, I just reached for my mouse in the old location again for I don't know how many times that's been now. And I think I need a coffee. Oh, do you? Co coffee break so in game. I don't. And I think I know why. Because I don't have a little bed icon at the bottom of my screen. <laughs> Peter. Uh, I'm thinking... I'm thinking I uh, forgot to turn off. Peter. Uh, yes, Iris. As a matter of fact, it is. Um, if you... Here, let's try this, Iris. Type in exclamation point ETS. it worked there you go click on that that is a uh, that gives you every mod I'm running in this profile in the exact order I'm running it in and then where I got them from and I can tell you that I believe every one of those mods is actually from the Steam Workshop except Z mods oh yeah except Z mods correct and PNG and JPX. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, that's true. The graphic stuff is not... Keep left. Keep left. Okay, why were you trying to go right, Ty? She said keep left. And I also have the same thing for ATS, Iris. Which obviously you can just type exclamation point ATS and then you'll get that as well. Keep right. After 50 yards, turn right. And there's actually Iris, um. Turn right. And I think it's from the same person that did the ETS mod, made the same thing for ATS. So you could actually do this on Keep left. American after trucks too. 50. Although, depending on the truck, it looks really dumb. 
where the camera ends up. And as you'll see by those two documents, Iris, I have a crap ton more mods in my ATS. I think I'm up to 146. You're welcome, Iris. But now that you did that, that makes me think I should... Um, Because when I see Ty like that, I think people are saying my name, but I, I get that it's thank you, so I should just put that as a command. Keep right after 50 yards, exit right ahead. And then Streambot would respond with like how amazing right I am or something like that. I really need to pay attention driving in, instead of reading chat because I almost rear-ended you again. Yeah, I have the same issue with uh, track IR when I look on the right of the chat. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> my, my screen is all, all to the right. My camera view. I really need a uh, coffee break and, of course, no gas stations. You know, that raises an interesting question. And I guess I should, I, it's a dumb, now that I think about it, it's a dumb question because of the off-ramp sizes, but I was going to ask if it's like in the States where you could, you know, pull off on an off-ramp and After 50 yards, exit left. take a nap. Well, in, in real life, uh, truck left. drivers in Europe, uh, they sleep in different places, many different places, but here in game it's of course it has to be this blue icon. Um, by the way, funny part, uh, I have rain. <laughs> That is so ridiculous. <laughs> Keep right. I don't. After 50 yards, exit right ahead. And it's like full rain with dark sky and everything. Exit right ahead. It is a perfectly nice night on my screen. Which I guess you can probably see since you have the... After 100 yards, turn right. So the bot's working for that. It would be interesting if Turn nobody's... Right. Um, subscribe to see if that works. It does when I click the test button all day long, but... And I guess I learned something interesting, too, that if a if someone doesn't have their subscription sent up set to public after 100 yards turn right it won't even show the notification turn right i guess i don't need to do a Yeah, Mason, that's after one hundred yards. Hey, look, turn left. Next high water bottle. I don't know turn if I set left. that up or not. After fifty yards, turn right. If I did, that would be exclamation point merch. Right. But I don't know if I set that one up. I think part of that, Mason, is 
honestly, according to the analytics after the stream is over, I don't think I have yet to get a subscriber during the stream. Accident in front of me, truck versus bus. <laughs> and now uh, car. <laughs> oh, okay, so you're talking about the actual live stream itself. That's interesting, because I, I mean, I got one. I even got an email, as a matter of fact, that said Necktie Gaming has gone live. I'm glad you got the ping in Discord, though, because at least the bot is working today. It's a good thing this was an external contract with your uh, wrong turn. Or missed turn. Not making fun of you, because I make those all the time. You in this game. Your destination. Dang. Really? That's where it wants it? Do I need to move? Oh, you already... Are you, are you already back? No? Oh. Okay, so I need to change the average window length again. This crap worked fine earlier today when I tested it. And now that I've played a while, it speeds up again. I really wish SCS would get off their ass and, like, just update the damn game, right? Stop DLC crap. Stop all that crap. Just update the damn game engine. And get your shit together. That's my philosophy, anyway. That's weird that you get them for the videos, but not the streams. Alright, let's take a look at this. We're in a no collision area, right? So I can actually back up while you're backing up? Yeah, I think so. I mean, it doesn't look very realistic, but... I need to find the sleeping spot. Just... turn off fatigue simulation. <laughs> no, it's... I like it real. spot or not. Oh no, I'm going to the right spot. Now we'll see if there is no collision area. There should be. I mean, there shouldn't be a collision. No, driving yeah. through my trailer. Is that a spe special gear shift? Um, yes and no. One moment. Let me, let me get backed up here. I'm trying to see. So the base is a Fanatec Club Sport. Down there. So the shifter is a Fanatec Club Sport, bottom line. And, uh... Which... Let me look up there. So where my finger is right now is where the actual... This is going to sound weird. But where the actual factory shaft stops. Right there. And then it comes with two different knobs that you can screw onto it. 
but I looked up the thread pattern. Sorry, I'm probably going to get technical. Anyway, I looked up the thread pattern on the internet for the Fanatec shifter, and then I went to, I got these two aluminum extensions from sixspeed.com and then this shifter is an actual Eaton Fuller shift knob from atsaccessories.com and what it is you've seen probably seen some of these people that have these chrome shifters with a ball on the top well he uses the guts out of this actual shifter to make those and then he 3D prints an inside for the chips and everything and then puts it back together. So this is considered his budget shifter and it's like 50 bucks versus his custom shifters are, they start at 300. Hey, what's going on, Drop Dead? Uh, you'd be surprised. We're doing quite well for ourselves. <laughs> oh, I gotta shut the truck off. Okay. This cloud bot's pissing me off. Because that's another setting I have turned off. Is the whole caps thing. And... Oh, add that to my, as a matter of fact, uno momento, take a note here, Streamlabs, chatbot, settings. Yeah, I think I think Streamlabs does it automatically and it's um I would try and minimize and see if I can fix it, but why is Oh, you need a plate, hold on. Oh, you already went over there. Never mind. Yeah, just take a nap. I'm ready to roll. Job market. Why is... Okay, so that's not looking very well. Yeah, see, and the other thing that really frustrates me, Mason, about that is because I don't remember seeing his name before. So, like, that could turn somebody off from, you know, ever coming back to the stream. Even though I am positive I unchecked every one of those damn... Where are we at? Are we in we Vienna? We are in Vienna. Yeah, Vienna. Well, according to my icon, we're not even close to Vienna, but... Um... Yeah, somewhere close to Vienna, but... Jeez, that's Lithuania. Um... Netherlands. Go to Netherlands. We go visit Iris. Where was that at? The short should be an L. No NLs. By the way, you can use your mouse wheel to scroll these pages. You don't have to click these dots on, on the bottom. It's kind of fun clicking. 
Okay. <laughs> no. Um... Wow, that's a lot. <laughs> I will make there. you some food. We may. Hold on. Lithuania. Oh, that's close. I don't know how to say that. Oberhausen? Whatever D is. Let's head to, to, towards the Netherlands. Dortmund. Um, needs to be there Saturday. Yeah, whatever. So we're playing without this uh, fatigue simulation? Oh, D equals situation. Gotcha. Um, yeah, I, I don't have it on right now, I guess. Okay, I'll, I'll turn this off also. Okay, I just had happen what you were talking about. Turn left. I've looked left and right like three times and start to go and then all of a sudden the car's right there. I told you. After 100 yards, Do you remember right. where are you going? Turn Which company? Right. Because uh, until you yards, get the, the load, right. uh, I don't know where, where are you? Uh, where are you going? Cargo market. It is pork picking up at Euro Acres. Going to Euro Goodies in Oberhausen, which I'm probably saying that wrong. Do you see it? Yeah, I see on the stream, but I don't see Euro Acres. Oh yeah, oh yeah, all the way top. It's one hundred and. 140 kilometers? Oh my god. Almost 150 to, to pick up the load. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Like, nothing was right where we were picking up. Slow down, almost. Okay, there we go. Got it. Oh, you're back there. I guess I could slow down. I'll turn. I'll turn my flashers on. Actually, I can see if they speed up again now. Yeah, they do. What do you have your average window link set at? Me? Mm hmm. 120. Yeah, see, that screwed mine up. And I had it set to 60, and it, um, it was fine at the start, but the longer I play, the worse it gets for some reason. I may just put it back to factory 20 and see how it goes. That's kind of cool that I can see you down on the map. You're just now entering the pigtail. It's funny, I just looked in my right mirror and I'm like, yep, that's Chris coming right. alive. <laughs> Looks like the sun coming up over the horizon. Yeah, baby. 
Okay, are we keeping right, right? Yes. Okay. Do you need, do you need a little brightness in your cabin? Well, I was about to say I couldn't tell if it was the street lights or if it was you, but I think it's probably... No, you're far enough back. I think it's the street lights. Oh, tunnel. Crappy horn. Keep left. Nice echoing tunnel. I got sidetracked. If hopefully drop dead is still here. Um, if you are drop dead, I saw Keep part left. of that before they uh, the damn bot got all pissy. Um, this is just my first truck. There will be others. Really? You had to go slow like that just to get in the left lane. And then come back in the right lane. I think the guy at SCS that was programming AI traffic maybe was in the sauce that day a little bit. Or maybe that's how he drives in, in real life. Uh, that could be. Hey, Mo Gaming, how you doing? Thank you for stopping by. Turn right. Turn right. Okay. All right, and and right. Keep right. Keeping right. I feel pretty good about myself at the moment. I the only thing I've hit was that guardrail right at the beginning. There's plenty of time for you to show your skills. True skills. <laughs> yeah. That is that is true. Thank you for the support, Mo. Been watching the ATS series nonstop, even at work. That's dedication. That's a nice job. When you can watch YouTube videos. I'm guessing you, <laughs> you don't care about the speed limits. Oh, I thought we were governed. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we're at governed at 90. Okay, got it. But it's 80. So, n no fatigue simulation and no fines, right? No, I have fines on. I just haven't seen a cop, apparently. <laughs> yeah, sure. Now you're gonna make me go check when we get loaded here to see if I have fun. I'm pretty sure I do. Keep right. After 50 yards, exit right ahead. Exiting right. Exit right ahead. After 100 yards, turn okay, right. Okay, could they have made this interchange any more? Ridiculous? What the hell? Turn right. Turning right. Well, at least there's a sign that tells us to go this way. 
Turn left. I think my GPS just said keep left, turn right. Yeah, I think. Which makes no sense. I think they do get mixed up sometimes. Maybe it's like the first iteration of GPS wh where you can uh, drive to the lake or something like that. CAD tried recording today in ETS 2, and after playing ATS so long, ETS 2 looks so bad. I, uh. I can't disagree. I have noticed, unless maybe because we're driving at night now, though. But I haven't noticed the uh, texture swap near as bad in ETS. But we are mostly in the vanilla uh, content. Uh, and Italy oh, or so France the... looks, looks much better. But, but what I'm talking about is the texture swapping with like the JBX and you know what I mean? On the buildings? Yeah. I would imagine if you take out that prefab pack um, from JBX, it would probably stop it, but I don't know if that would make the whole thing look like crap or break it, so I didn't try that. Wow, good lord. That's not JBX, so that's the game engine. Can't handle the textures after Montana. Oh... Okay. Imagine that. Something else the game engine can't handle. Shocking. Hey, Ty, you moved your mouse yesterday, just so you know. We're taking some pork. Where am I? Oh, over there. No, I'm not going to skip loading. Is that a hidden road? I bet you that's a hidden road. What are we picking up at? This looks like a BGA from... It is. That's a shit pit right there. Oh. Why is there straw in there? That's like a slurry pit. Anyway. Shit pit being a technical term. Or actually, I guess slurry pit would be the technical term. Just more fun to say shit pit. Wow, I messed that up. We should be alright though. Nope, I gotta pull up because I'm an idiot. Well, that is... <laughs> that's a good point, Iris. Good point. I think I see all the chat the messages with delay. Because uh, I don't see right now any message from Myers. Oh, you don't? Even in the uh, YouTube? No, no. The last message I see is from Kat. Uh, about the textures. Come on, that's too much. That's the last I see. Interesting. I haven't looked up at OBS much, so I don't even know if yeah, they're, yeah, maybe if they're popping like up on the change. damn screen.
Okay, I had something like top chat. Now I have chat on live, chat live, and I see all. Okay. Oh, so you Fixed. had. Okay, got it. I'm going first. You are going first. Oh, you're loaded. I didn't know you were loaded already. Sorry. Last I saw, you were parked over. Of course, I'm loaded. Oh, okay, yep, there it is. Now I see it when I look up at OBS. It. Yeah, I figured that would be delayed. Maybe that's the reason why not uh, all chat messages uh, displayed on the on the overlay. Maybe you also have this top chat selected. No, it's uh, it's another thing in Streambot's CloudBot thing. You don't. There's not a choice to select which. It oh, just okay. pulls it. <clears throat> which I'm not a. F I mean, I'm not Doing a fan good of job it. So far. Sounds better. Stream delay under six seconds, per, so pretty good. Yeah, that is pretty good. Normally it's like seven to ten. After 100 yards, turn right. But as you know, Cat, I could get that down more right. if I uh, wanted to stream in 1080p after 100 yards turn right turn right Chris there's a question for you do we have news on the paint jobs for SSL and ETS 2 Nope, no answer from uh, ETS2 support. And I sent two mails, two emails. <laughs> yeah, so that's uh, that's interesting, Kyoshi. Um, like Chris had said before, maybe they have two separate teams at SCS. Which would make sense, I guess, one for ETS, one for ATS, and apparently the ETS people don't Turn like right. shit show logistics, so they took the mod down. But yet the ATS mod has approaching 3,000 subscribers right now. Well, I think I uh, I will wait a few more days. If they do not respond, uh, I will write one more email to uh, SCS, not to ETS support, but directly to SCS. If they didn't respond, uh, I think we're gonna have to put this somewhere on Google Drive. Yeah, I agree. But if you lower the delay more, you will get trouble with buffer health. Correct. Plus, cat, I just like all my shit in LBS is set. Um, with the output and all that being twenty-five sixty by fourteen forty, just makes it easier for my brain to process too. Oh, Chris Cad says if they don't respond, let him know. He thinks he can help. So, Cad, do you know people in, in SCS software? <laughs> Would not surprise me. <laughs> My horn sucks. Is this one any better? No, that's not any better. He says a few. Yeah, so if you know 
someone from them you can ask directly why this mod is banned yeah why then why then why they banned the, banned the mod oh my god and then hopefully they don't be like wait a minute one slid by an ats and then they take that one down <laughs> yeah for sure that's uh, for sure I'm, I'm that's what i'm worried about That one's been up for how long though now? I mean, it's got a four star rating. I don't know, like one month? It has a four star rating and approaching 3,000 subs, so I don't know. Um, yeah, I don't know. And the funny part was the one that you uploaded to Steam for ETS wasn't even an actual, that was, didn't you have yeah, that labeled dev? Yeah, friends like only. That. Yeah, friends only. So it wasn't even out there for the public, and they... It's like work in progress. Had a fit about it. And Kat, I don't know if you, you know the story, but he put that up there on Steam and got an email. So then he sent Steam an email, and Steam is like, basically, like, we didn't do that. That was, that was the developer. He said, if you look at Krizzy's mods on stream, trust me, your name is more than okay. Yeah, but to be honest, I don't even know why they uh, banned this mod. Because th there is no explanation, no reason, no info, nothing. It's just violating the Steam rules. Uh, and bye. See you later. Yeah, which is funny, they say violating the Steam rules, but Steam didn't take it down, they took it down. Um... I think you're probably what you said is probably what happened. Somebody either knew or whatever is, uh, I don't know, new to the support team or something like that that didn't really understand. I don't know. I don't know, some defender of purity or something like that. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> No shit under my watch. Kat, I will, uh, I will send you a link to the mod because I, I don't think. Oh no, but we are friends on right. Steam, so you can After check my my mod mod list. Exit right ahead. I think we are because you. I think you have different nickname on Steam, right? Exit right ahead. Well, we don't even have that mod. Isn't even on Steam anymore. Right? Didn't they yeah, 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 it is. Oh. It is, but it's blocked. It's banned. Oh, gotcha. Keep left. Yeah, Cat says, says you guys are. Yeah, yeah, I remember that uh, he has different nickname. Man, you are so far ahead. Oh, am I? Okay. Yeah, no, no problem, but I think you are push the pedal to the metal. Yeah, I was. I wasn't paying attention. Well, that's something new. <laughs> well, I get to... I'm watching chat and everything. I just, you know, have my foot. Because I think that since we're governed, I don't take into account that... Like, we'd be okay now because it, the speed limit's 100 right where I'm stopping by. I think I need to make my, make my stability a little higher. I almost rolled over. Did you turn it all the way down? No, it's like 25%, uh, something about uh, around. But I think it's way too low, especially, yeah, I'm right behind you, you can go. Yeah, I saw so I can go first. I saw you as I was blinded by the light. <laughs> uh, we have this uh, realistic Chuck Physics mod, and in the description of this mod, it, it says that you, to work properly, you need to have these settings at, at 100. Really? At 100? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All the way to the up, to the right. 
And we're running the same mod in ATS, right? It's the yeah, same by the yeah, same exactly. Frank. Exactly. Interesting. So th there is no explanation what will happen if you lower the settings, but I don't know. I'm guessing something like I did a minute ago. I may have to try that though, because I had mine initially at like 75% in ATS, and I could take corners way too fast for what the load was, so I lowered it. So I wonder, if... I wonder what happens if you go to 100% if it like tells the mod to then work. I don't know. Well, you are basically like a F1 bullet, F1 car. Because that sounds almost like Z mods, like because in his documentation he tells you to turn all your stuff to 100. Yeah, but this in Z mods it's because uh, all his mods are much more quiet uh, than the other mods which, uh, or the other game sounds. If you check, uh, you you can make you can compare with uh, Kishbaum mod. His engines are way louder. I think I need to pull somewhere for some gas station. Wow, you're getting crappy fuel mileage. No, I didn't have full tank. Oh. Before we started. I did. Yeah, I was not prepared. Uh, back to the stability settings i think 50 is this is like safe safe range that makes sense cad he said that z mods are not as loud as he is the only one who really does the 3d with different sounds yeah yeah I just found out the perfect idea for uh, episode number 100. What? You will go, of course if you want, with all the settings of stability and braking at zero. That's not far off from what I am now, honestly. <laughs> yeah, try that. Set everything to zero. Stiffness, stability, trailer track, stability break strength zero <laughs> this could be fun no i know it'll happen instantly the minute i get loaded i'll go to take a turn and tip over going 20 miles an hour so go go slow or maybe as a 100 episode your sugar mama could drive instead of you. Oh, good lord. This is perfect. As a practice before she, she gets her own rig. A no GPS session would be awesome. Yeah, also. Nice, nice idea, Kesh. 100th episode of Seto Corsa. <laughs> <laughs> that would be funny actually cad if i if i did do that keep the same thumbnail look road to five million and everything and then just do an aceto corsa video <laughs> Yeah, it has to be something different, something special. Maybe not has have to be, but uh, it, it, it could be fun. Yeah, like buying a Freightliner Cascadia. Yeah, pink one. A bo bo borrowing one from, from Jacob.
I am gonna pull off. Fuel time. If you see a set of course it looks now, you won't. Well, honestly, CAD, to be quite honest, I could probably, if I still had an N64, put in Super Mario Kart and probably wouldn't want to come back. I know that's kind of a bit of an exaggeration, but it's not too far off. Look at that guy in Cabrio at night. A guy what? In Cabrio. A car without roof. How oh. do you say? Conver convertible. Oh, wow. I took off before my guy even had a seatbelt on. Hold on, buddy. <laughs> One of you cars are going to have to stop because there we go. Well, full traffic, everybody's going to work. It's 5 a.m. Yeah, it really is, Cad. I wish I could just find something and be like, you know, what is it, Ron Popeil, the set it, forget it with his air fryer thing back in the day. Um, yeah, it's nuts. Even changing my 60, um, I don't know if you're here before, but even changing my average window length to 60 again, it worked for a little bit. And uh, even now, I think, I can't tell because of the truck but it still doesn't uh, it seemed like in the last episode I recorded um, it was fine at the beginning of the game or beginning of the episode and like halfway through then it started speeding up again so I don't know hey drop dead thank you for hanging out coming back no you don't need to apologize about the caps um Streambot needs to do their damn job because I am 100% certain I turned all of that crap off and double checked it so I don't know why it kicked you it kicked CAD too for writing too long of a sentence so oh yeah that is okay the one CPU core thing. So this, so actually ATS would probably run better if I had my very first computer I bought in like 1990, when was it, 1998, a 486DX2 with a 320 megabyte hard drive. Damn thing was top of the AMD. line. No, no AMD. It was Intel, right? 486. Yeah, 486 DX2. And then I was so old days. I remember when I got it because I was so pissed because like six months after I got it, they came out with the Pentium processors. I was like, damn it. <laughs> That's <laughs> these are old days. Well, my first computer was actually. Commodore 64, then was Amiga 500, then, then PC. I remember the Commodores. The, uh, remember the good old 14 4 Cross kilobit line. modems? <laughs> With the dial up internet connection. With the specific sound. Yeah. Right? Like... <laughs> <laughs> At least you tried to do that. <laughs> I don't think it sounds even remotely like this, but... Oh, sorry, car. You should watch out. Or I should watch out one of the two. I was reading. 
First GPU is two megs. Yards, turn right. Mag 3DFX add on card. Turn right. Good lord. Oh. I'm not in the States. See how that did that again? Oh, it's raining again. Well, at least it's raining for both of us now. Yeah, it's speeding up again. Yeah. Anyway. Congratulations to SCS Software. Guess I could turn on my wipers off. Keep left. After 50 yards, turn left. Turn left. Oh, and lightning. Look at that. And thunder, even. <laughs> I thought we were getting close, it's, and it's still way over 600 kilometers. Oh, is it? Oh, wow. Cross the rotary. First exit. Yeah, Truckee is telling me up in the upper right-hand corner that we have 39 minutes of real-world time. What model Scania are you driving? I have a R450 currently. Driving a DAF. I have the uh, Scania... What the hell is it? The S, S model. Oh, S the model. S model. Okay. The newest one in, in base ATS, in vanilla ATS. At least ATS. somebody knew. Running the Z mods Scania V8. Are you behind me, or am I ahead of you? I'm in front of you. Oh. What am I? I'm, I feel like I'm driving Miss Daisy back here. Like, where the hell am I? Yeah, we are in Germany right now, and I think that uh, part of Germany is reworked already, so it looks better than Poland, for example. Could you two figure this out? Well, that's quite the pedestrian bridge. Or is that for actual cars, too? Appeared it may have been for actual cars as well. Oh, you bastard. When I see this traffic in front of me, I think that uh, this idea of no, no traffic mode, it, it might be actual good idea. I just almost got in one hell of an accident, but... Was there this uh, accident back here when you came through? Nope. Yeah, there is now. And now I've, I'm stuck because this AI traffic doesn't want to move. All right. 
you know you, what you can try to do. Uh, yeah, I know. Change, change something in graphic settings. I know exactly. So the game I, I know exactly what I'm gonna do. Yeah, Dev Console. Oops. I messed that up. I need to do that over. I was too close to the ground. <laughs> Oops. Let's uh, get turn, turned up. Where is your truck? Well, it. Uh, I need to find the road again, quite honestly. <laughs> how, how the hell did you fall off the bridge? I was, uh, apparently, I was too close to the ground. There we go. Well, sir, that is indeed a uh, shit show. <laughs> Yeah, now my truck is completely red. It's probably gonna, it's probably gonna quit. Hey, congratulations. Oh yeah, it sounds bad too. It, she's still running though. Doesn't sound very good shifting. Yeah, so if anyone was wondering what happens if you're too close to the road, and then you try and spawn in, um, that right there. Or, engine malfunction, nice. You know what I'm gonna have to do? Find the service? Yeah, it would be nice if there was one on here, but anyway, I'm gonna go to service and then I will, uh, we'll find out where you're at when I do that. Not that okay. one, this one. I must be close. I'm going to Dresden. It's only costing 656 euro, but it's going to take an hour and 33 minutes. Yeah, I passed Dresden. Oh, so we we're almost there then. All right. Well, now yeah, I will wait for you somewhere. Safe place. Service. How much is this going to cost? 177,000 euro. Wow. I basically destroyed the trailer, the body and the chassis. 100% damage. Chassis on the truck's 100% damage. Fantastic. That has been my worst service bill yet. <laughs> At least you have something to repair, but imagine that in real life, truck falling off the bridge. I've actually had one um, when I first, oh crap, 43% damage on the cargo. Turn right. Um, when I first did the dev console thing, I didn't have that happen, but what I did have happen was my truck spawned halfway into the ground and halfway out of the ground. After 100 yards, 40 percent damage of the cargo. Yeah, I got 43 percent. Oh, it's turn still up there. So, that's so you you damaged the pork, right? Yeah, I damaged the pork. I don't know how you can damage the pork, but there are so many jokes there. Yeah, I damaged the pork. Ooh, I didn't mean to hit the... <laughs> now your road to the dark side is complete, said Jacob. I should, uh... I should make a cup holder for my... my water bottle. Actually, I need to look on Etsy. I can probably order a 3D printed one. Yep, leaving Dresden. Well, now we only have 34 minutes real world time. I 
I can't believe I did that. I thought I was far enough away from the pavement. Of course, right. I don't know what was behind me. That may have done it too. Okay, so I am Turn waiting right. for you. Uh, first gas station uh, behind Dresden. I am headed towards Berlin here in one moment as soon as the light turns green so I can get on the highway or whatever it's called over there. Can you go right on red in Europe? No? Yes? Only if there is a green light. Ah, green, gotcha. green arrow. Uh, sorry, green arrow. Seeing it's opposite in the States, if you can't turn right on red, there's a sign that says no right on red. <laughs> but the way uh, ATS program crap, they didn't take into account that a truck has to pull straight ahead before it can just turn immediately right and so you'll get a fine which is dumb yeah that was my confusion about when when you can tur turn right on the right in the US Iris is your city in ETS2 is this in game Dresden West, 1,000 meters. Wow, you must be a ways ahead. When you see this gas station, pull, pull over and uh, refuel, and we can start from the... I'm good on fuel. Well, I have 897 of 1,000 liters, 896. If Irish city is in uh, it okay. is too. We can go to her city if it's there. She fell asleep. She hasn't responded yet. Yeah. No, no. She's thinking, should I say where I live? Let's think about that. That's a valid point. <laughs> Tomorrow, uh, half of the people here are <laughs> at her doorstep. Keep left. checkpoint let's see if I can't screw this up oh no it's not a border checkpoint it just says a four it looks like there is uh, six one two three four, five. yeah six Dutch cities So that guy has. Oh, hey, look, I see you. Preparing for winter. This is for his fireplace. Well, he's got a lot of work to do then to get those suckers down to fit in his fireplace. Yeah, <laughs> you put one Keep at the beginning of the winter and it, and it will last till the end of the winter. Oh, you are here, I think. Yeah. Yep. straight 
So you did your fuel. You told me to. <laughs> and you always listen to what I told you? What I, what I tell you? Absolutely. You're the president of the European Operations Division. <laughs> but you are the big boss. I was wondering what I hit. I ran over the curb. Okay, so I took off, um, but I'm driving like 50, so you should catch me. Go straight. You know what I'm thinking would be fun? Is Ruta's Freightliner Classic XL with a Cummins Signature 600 motoring down these roads? I don't know uh, um, if uh, Signature 600 is available for ETS, but it, it probably XL isn't. For sure. Jacob says hello, Mr. President. Yeah. Probably he's proud that he knows the president. Well, he should be. That's how he got his pink Freightliner Cascadia. I just, I just told you that I have a friend who, who, who right. looks like this guy and he drives Cascadia. The rest is yours. I didn't tell you to paint it pink. Well, that's true. I, I, I did that. That was my own creativity. And trust me, pink is not the favorite color of Jacob. More of a muted pink, not a hot pink. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> All kind of pink. To be honest, I don't think I ever saw him in, uh, in pink shirt or something pink. I'm trying to keep left, but this flipping traffic. There's literally like a traffic jam behind you again, moving at. Yeah, that, that's uh, another um, thing. I'm, I'm thinking I'm right. Uh, so, uh, if I go first, I will, uh, I, I will spawn traffic and also traffic behind me. So you are spawning your traffic and my and you are getting mine from from behind from behind of me. If that makes sense. And that's why it gets all dorked up. That does make sense, which I mean it would make sense if you could just one run or one person run it, but yeah, we'll try it for tomorrow. Take them out and yeah, I know. I know. I'm pretty sure that idea makes sense. I don't know if my English makes sense. No. What would what would almost make sense then is if you took out the traffic mod, so you could actually try a couple different things. Take out the traffic mod, and then run a convoy. See how it goes. If it's maybe too barren, well, then what happens if one of us were to hop in our config file and put g traffic underscore one point five? Right? Just one of us. I don't know. Because that's not a mod, so that it doesn't have to match, right? I don't know. Just Without the traffic mod, it should be okay. I don't know why they, they didn't do this like... If you host uh, a session, you decide what mods you, you want to run, and uh, people who join, they have these mods. Maybe not downloaded, but I don't know, somehow hosted on the SCS server or something like that. Yeah, that's where it gets tricky too, because of paid mods and non-paid mods. Yeah, paid mods are. Um, I guess what would what would be nice is if there's some way of, you know how like the rooted trucks have a key, a personal key, that you could put that mod in the server, 
but in order for somebody to use it, they would have to have the personal key on their local machine, right? Proving that they basically paid for it, sort of thing. I don't know. Yeah, it's kind of like uh, in a dreams. Although I guess that's nothing different than everybody. I guess what I'm trying to figure out, but I guess that's harder for the game. If there's like some base mods that everybody had to have the same, but if you wanted to run different trucks, you wouldn't have to have the same truck mods, but then in order for that to populate in the other person's game and actually see it on the road, they would have to... Yeah, anyway. We have two choices. Either accept it, as it is, or... Uh, wait for new game. Well, new tracking game. Yeah. Which is basically just accepting it for what it is. It's gonna be. I'm gonna be real interested tomorrow to see if this traffic does all this crazy crap that it's doing in front of me right now. To be and honest, we can test this after the stream, like, I don't know, 5-10 minutes uh, override of, of the stream. And I'm and willing. see if it changes everything, anything. I'm sure it will. That's why I'm thinking just pulling it out is going to be fine. You know, and if tomorrow, if there's, you know, four cars on the road, then alright, there's four cars on the road and we know. But I don't think that's going to be the case. It's not going to be like Trucker's MP where there's no cars. Is that Hessa? Hesse? Hesse? For some reason I'm thinking Hessa. I don't know. Wow. I learned five five years uh, we actually German, have, we actually have some scenery I can't speak German after five years of learning in, in school my truck stability is kind of low all right get back in here and drive no well, actually I can say I I always laughed that I I won't die from hunger and I won't be lost in Germany because I know how to say Ich möchte zehn Brötchen kaufen, which means I want to buy some bread. I don't know how do you call this in English. And I know straight left, right, so I want to get lost. Perfect. All right, now I'm finally got one vehicle between us, and I may have touched that one back there. I don't think I did. Finish tires. Sir, you have a suspension problem because you're jerking around over there. Keep left. Jesus, I looked for a second on the chat and almost lost it. Well, the good thing is, Billy, at least you still have your wheel, and you don't have to buy a whole new wheel. The funny part is, Billy, I've only been playing ATS for... Hmm. A year? Maybe a year and a half? But at the time, I was actually still driving a truck in real life, so I didn't have that much time. But then when I sold the truck, I started playing this more, and then was beat into submission by my two bonus kids and the wife that I should start a YouTube channel because I'd be really good at it. So here I am. I don't know how good at it I am, but...
having what fun. Is B? B A is struggling. Keep right. Uh oh, two minutes. Two minutes and episode 97 goes keep live. Right. After 50 oh, keep yards, right. Exit right ahead. Exit right ahead. Yeah, this GPS is also messed up. It should give you some clues before. Instead of right when you get to the... <laughs> yeah, like like a real, real GPS does it. In one mile, turn right or something like that. I appreciate that, Billy. I am having fun. Well, it's Billy the Fort. True. Are we in the new updated part? Uh, I think so. Uh, I have uh, a way to, to know this. Uh, observe the lines. If they are round, nice, it's a new part. If they are like made from straight lines, it's the old content. The lines on the road? Yeah, yeah. Uh, especially in the cities or this... Uh, this... Uh, I don't know how to say this. Uh, A uh, very... Uh, never mind. <laughs> no. Uh, if you have to make... Uh, hard turn. Hard turn. Okay, gotcha. Because the... I, I mean, even the foliage seems different, but I didn't know if that was just me or not. Keep right. After 50 The yards, biggest difference right in, in the... Visuals I saw in uh, Italy and France right so far. Turn right. I was wondering why that truck got over. He didn't even have to. I'll watch this green car come back over in front of me now when I get up by it, I bet. There's one of them Osfarts back there. I saw the sign. <laughs> Osfarts. <laughs> That's what I said, Osfart. You, you have to speak this with correct German accent auswärts or i could just say exit i hope i'm not offending any, anybody from germany
North Rhine. Hello, Stuart. Stuart, what's going on? It's double Stuart. It is. Stuart squared. Look at this rock on the right. Perfect. <laughs> yeah, that rock literally looked like some out of Super Mario Brothers. Or Minecraft. Either one. So it's like your first name it's and last name? It's Stuart Stuart. That's kinda cool. Yeah, it would be cool. Like Johnny Joe. Keep left. After Keep fifteen left. yards, go straight. You know what I'm learning? Go straight. That I need to slow down, number one. Another Alsvart. Exactly. I'm learning that my uh, bladder does not like as much intake of liquid consumption when I'm streaming. Break, 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 break. Well, this is like real life. One guy did something stupid on the road and everybody stopped, stopped to take a picture. Yeah. Yeah, and the accident isn't even on our side, but yet everybody came to a complete stop. Wow, that guy had a trailer fire. Don't run into that truck, Ty. Speaking of names, is your name, uh, is it the full name or is it short from something like Tyler or something like that? It is just Ty, T-Y. Two that's so whole cool. letters. Yeah, that's so cool to have a name from two letters. As I normally tell people, I think my parents just looked at me when I was born and realized I was going to be an idiot, so they gave me something short and easy to spell so I could look smart in grade school. No, they, they should, they, they, they thought thank you, but thank you is too long, so they did it tight. T-Y. I actually don't know where they came up with Ty. I do know if I, if I would have come out a girl, I would have been April. <laughs> April. It's like a month. How do you, how, how can you be, <laughs> how can this be name and, and the month? I don't know, because that would have been really good because I was born in December. So I'd have been April born in December. Keep yeah, right. and After if your last name was yards, May, April, right. May. I'm pretty sure turn there's right. somebody named that, actually. <laughs> I don't know them, but it wouldn't surprise me if somebody's actually named April, May. Keep right. Which also is kind of right. cool. Has a nice ring to it. Now that Turn I'm right. curious, if you can pronounce my real name, because uh, Chris is like like a nickname based on my name. <laughs> I'm curious, curious if you can pronounce my Polish name. Do <laughs> you want to try? Um. Okay. Okay. Krzysztof. I don't know if I can do that. I thought that's. But see, I would say it Kristoff, not with the ch in there, which is, is probably... But you can make that sound, right? Ksh. 
Kristoff. No, oh, for almost, some reason, almost, I, almost nice. my my tongue and my teeth don't want to cooperate to make the uh, the proper um, native sound. I guess is the word I was looking Keep for. Keep right after fifty yards. Exit right ahead. What always amazes me right is ahead. that in English you have many sounds uh, we have in Polish, but they are spelled different, right? Typed different. But you can use these sounds in your words, but you cannot in our. I don't know why. Turn left. Well, I'm sure some of us can. I can't because I don't have that kind of brain power <laughs> like for example in English you have CH right like right you, like, you cheese. like yeah cheese check uh, chance checkers like, ch ch not ch at the beginning right and in Polish we have uh, C Z and it's uh, it sounds the, the same like ch and you can't say this don't know why. Well, because in our brain, a C and a Z don't go together. <laughs> right? So. And, and especially because you guys have H's, right? So then that would confuse me even more. Well, oh. Uh, oh, well, sorry, car. Damage 1%. I wasn't paying attention. To your defense, uh, Polish language is not the easiest language in the world. Hey, Aaron, how's it going? Doing hey. good. Hey, Aaron. I feel like my eyeballs are floating, but we're almost to the delivery point, so. Sad part is, I used the restroom before we started. Getting old sucks. Keep right. After 50 yards, turn right. Turning right. I'll be in the Netherlands turn tomorrow. Right. Autobahn. We're not going to the Autobahn, though. Apparently, we have to deliver. And I have to deliver my 43% damage pork. I'm surprised with the 100% damage I had on a complete trailer. Chassis and frame and box or whatever that uh, I even have any pork left in it. 50 yards, turn right. Turn right. Well, imagine the pork inside, if you open the door. You have your yeah, it probably smells pretty bad, I'd imagine. Yeah, pork over the place. God, I reached for the mouse in the old location again. 845 kilometers. That's where you parked, was right there by the thing? Excuse me, one more time, please. You parked right by the wall? Was your parking spot? Or you just got yeah, down and parked? Yeah, yeah b because I don't have uh, always uh, this, this hard parking. I have random. So sometimes it's easy, sometimes it's hard. Oh, I have select. Or this not, not hard, difficult. I have select, and I always do the hard one. Because I have that little mod that gives you a thousand XP guaranteed for difficult parking. Well, actually, you do as well, because we're doing multiplayer, but. How did... I was doing so well on that, and then dorked it up right at the last minute. Well, not minute, second. I haven't been backing up for a full minute yet.
Do we have time for uh, another load? Uh, yes, we do. However, I am going to go hit the restroom right quick. Otherwise, yeah. But try, try to, f uh, try to find some load from here, so we wouldn't have to go like well, one that's what I did. kilometers. To pick up. That's what I did last time, sir. But there was nothing right where we were picking up. Ha! Sorry, man. Look at that. Did I actually have to pay? Well, you are the reckless man, so. What did that load pay? Uh, I have in Polish lot, it would be like 20 some thousand dollars. Yeah, well, I. Oh, 12, 20, 20, some, 20 something thousand euros. My, my damage penalty was 54,000 euro. Well, you, instead of pork, it's like, I don't know, mashed pork. Cow. I may have to, I may <laughs> have to stop really. driving and get, get behind my desk. Oh, hold on. Crap. I just messed that up. Where were we at again? I didn't hit the job market for where we're sitting right now. I exited out of that. We are in Euro goodies, right? Oh, look at that. Yeah, you're a goodies open house. Oh, that's housing. going from good lord, man. And what's, I think to what city are we in? Netherlands. Are we in Dortmund? No, no, no. Uh, Ober Oberhausen. Why? There it's we go. Be it's between Duisburg and Dortmund. Got it. Uh that's going to Denmark. Uh, oh, here we go. I by the way, you can type uh, uh, Oberhausen right. in, in such field. Oh, I found it. Um, we're going to take... Oh, that's from Metro. Where's Please Metro find, at? Find something to Netherlands. I I did, but it's coming out of Metro. Where's Metro at? Uh, just uh, not far. Little, little... I don't know. Like okay, one there's cheese and tomatoes tomatoes pay more so okay that's where we're going um it's picking up a metro i'm gonna go use the restroom so entertain eindhoven is it is it close to you iris what's that yeah i was i was asking iris is eindhoven close to her oh gotcha Yay! <laughs> Come to us. You can bring some food for us. <laughs> Tomatoes will be ketchup. If I will pick tomatoes. To be honest, he should be paid more for something like like that. You pick tomatoes, you deliver ketchup. <laughs> it's, it's perfect. Processing through the through the route. I feel like a new man. Yeah, I know that feeling. 
picks up whole tomatoes, delivers tomato paste. <laughs> oh, that's hey, how you doing, Brandon? It's fine. I deserve that. Maybe I was just delivering whole pork and I delivered pork chops. That was a bad dad joke. <laughs> like real bad. I and as a matter of fact, I apologize for that because that was. I don't even know if that was dad joke. Why are we stuttering, game? Stop it. Yeah, I have the same. And my frame, frame drops. Frame, frame per second dropped. After 100 yards, That's the game. turn left. Turn Stream left. health is still at 12 kilobits per second steady. Um, excuse me. She says after 50 yards turn left when I'm already in the turn turning. Okay, I am up metro waiting for you. Cross the rotary. Second Cross exit. the rotary. Exit one. Autobahn. Exit two. Exit ahead. Got it. Turn left. Keep left. After 50 yards, turn left. I will as soon as turn the light left. turns green. Okay, I'm gonna turn on my disco, so... You won't hit me. <laughs> turn left. Really? I need to turn left right here with all these car um excuse me, truck. Oh I do. Really? That's about dumb. Oh, and then we need to Reached your destination. Okay, so I need to Doom. wait for you to pick load. Oh, I thought I picked it. No, but oh. if you pick external, uh, it always shows up. But if you you have to drive to the if you pick the normal cargo, you have to drive there to pick. Okay, you should see it now then. Yeah, I see. scary oh well isn't this just a fun little pickup spot do I even have enough room oh wow this is going to be interesting Right through you. I gotta say, I love the ATS series. I've been listening to while uh, run my 18 wheel. Thank you, Brandon. I appreciate that. I used to do that same thing when I drove. Obviously, not listen to my videos because I wasn't doing this then, but you know what I mean. Um, I need to. Am I? No, not yet. Close. There we go. Did I really just hit that freaking car now? What truck do you drive, Brandon? If I may ask. I'm gonna hit this wall. I screwed this hit, up. Hit, hit whatever you like, man. It's your truck and your trailer. Yeah. 
I would prefer not to, though. Apparently it's raining. Yeah, real life, Brandon. Real life. In ATS, I, I think you probably drive everything. He's actually playing ATS while watching live. Look at that. Dedication. Love it. Yeah, if, I'm Engli if my English... Uh, if I had m better English, we could do like podcasts or something like that. I really wish I'd stop hitting that. Plastic Kenwood G8 880. Yeah, see? There are very few Americans that like them plastic trucks. <laughs> no shit. Although there are worse than a Kenworth T880. But I like Mac Anthem. I like a plastic truck. I like the look of it. Oh, Iris got out the popcorn. Why? Do you think I'm not going to... These tomatoes are going to be whole by the time we get them to to your country there, Iris. Just don't you worry. Iris, you better get pizza because <laughs> we're going to have ketchup at the end of Eindhoven. We ready? Okay. How did you get loaded so quick? Did you skip it? Nope. Doing those tricks. I got some magic skills. Now I had pretty easy uh, parking. Turn right. Yeah, it could be a Volvo or a Freightliner Cascadia. <laughs> Turn right. What I get fined for? Oh, loan installment. Well, that's technically a fine, in a way. Keep right. Cross the rotary. First exit. Exit ahead. After 100 yards, turn right. You know what I'm I... thinking, though? Go ahead. Yeah, yeah, go, go, go. Oh, I was, I was just thinking of... Turn right. Um, something that would, oh, good lord, I almost rear-ended you again. Um, something that would make me feel more at home in ETS. Is right uh, liner Classic XL. No, not at all. Kenworth K100. Oh, no, that may not be bad. Um, no, I was thinking a nice, you know, heavy haul load like a <laughs> like a low boy or something with a loader um I don't know anyway that was my thought not very exciting I know so Brandon Volvo is worse than Kenwood T8 T8 80 From my opinion, yes.
Brandon, I would love the P362. However, um, that's not available for ETS. Closest thing we can get is the K100. But that does remind me, Brandon, I need to bring out the 362 again. And I don't necessarily have a plan for Monday's Why video Why we are yet. not moving? I don't what know. You're in, you're in front of me. <laughs> so to answer your question, I'm not moving because you're in front of me. Okay, so apparent, apparently there are... I don't know how to describe this. A traffic jam. Enable external view and see for yourself. Well, it's just one of them fluster cucks. Can I swear on the stream? Yeah, you can do whatever you want to do. It's not made for kids. Okay, then fuck this shit, I'm out. Right. See, there you go. Um, Jacob said, only Cascadia. Plastic, but fantastic. <laughs> yeah. 100 yards, oh. turn right. Turn right. Like we My have... recommendation, go left lane. We have turn somebody... right. We have somebody honking. Yeah, I think the traffic mod has dorked all this up. How did I get 2% of trailer damage? What the f... I don't know, you got a long ways to go, because... Mine was 100% damaged. Good news about the new truck. Cool boss, he's been looking. Nice, man. Wanting those pizza I've been wanting. Very nice. Child, <laughs> everybody disco dancing. Is Kenworth the American Renault? Uh, no, I would say that would be a Freightliner Cascadia. If you want to know what the American equivalent of a piece of shit is, a court, just my opinion. But having owned and driven two of them, not a fan at all. Why two? You, you broke one? No, I finished the lease on one. Instead oh, okay. of just keeping it, uh, it was costing more. Um, it would have cost more to keep it than just to turn that one in and lease a new one. And this is kind of what I related to, I think, in one of the episodes of... I could have went to a bank and got finance to do, but that's it's a whole pain in the ass, so I just leased a brand new. The first one I had was a 2016, and then the one that I just sold at the end of 2021 was actually a 2021. Why did you lease uh, Cascadia in the first place if you hate it? Because the company that I was leased onto, that's all that they had. Oh, okay. And it's easier just to lease it through them or whatever um, versus going out and... Uh, I mean... <sighs> Keep left. I don't know. It was a nice... It was a comfortable truck. It's just they're ugly in my mind. Uh, Kiyoshi is right. Uh, international Lone Star is, <laughs> I don't know. That 
that's, yeah, not far off. He looks, it looks ridiculous. I don't know if a Freightliner is a Mercedes, though. Yeah, they are, because Freightliner and I think Western Star are part of Daimler. Daimler. And Daimler oh, is gotcha. the owner of Mercedes. Okay, I see where you're going with that one. That's why Cascadia and uh, all, all these, those new plastic Western Stars have the same dash. Yeah. And new Actros, Mercedes new Actros, uh, also has the same dash. And that's why the Kenworths and the Peterbilts have the same dash. Yep. But not not exactly the same, but they have this uh, this uh, engine display, engine parameters display. Keep right. After 50 yards, turn right. Turn right. Jesus Christ. <laughs> My trailer almost almost tipped. Mm -hmm. That it did. Way too low. I have the settings way too low. expects delivery very soon make sure to arrive on time well how about did they want tomatoes or do they want it already processed I don't have that I can do ketchup or tomato paste whichever you prefer see what about that load nice helicopter on a low boy um, I have nah, one right, hour, right, no way. I have one hour and 48 minutes left yeah I have Nokia sound right now Old, good, Nokia. Oh, so you're already late? Why do you have no, a Nokia no, uh, sound and I don't? It sound fixes, Buck. You should have. I know, but I don't. That's why I was wondering. Yeah, the SCS feature. But this Nokia sounds is uh, always when you have two hours to deliver. Oh, so my... No, I didn't even hear it when I had that. I don't know. Anyway. That's fine, I don't care. So unstable, I feel like I'm driving a bicycle or something like that on one <laughs> wheel. <laughs> We are not gonna see much of Netherlands because great and peaceful night. I don't know if we miss our turn, we may get to see a lot more of it. Yeah, but it's like uh, 11 p.m. <laughs> so it's, uh, I don't know, seven hours? Till the day. True. Keep right. After fifty yards, turn right. Turn right. Keep right. After fifty yards, turn right. Eindhoven. Turn right.
probably say sounded too German. I was about to reach down and hit my Jake brake switch and then realize that I don't have any. Yeah, you have retarder. Look oh, at that's that. what that was. Hey, that's the first time I've seen that. Thank you, Dramatic. Yeah, thank you, and bravo to Streamlabs. Yeah, for actually working. I heard the horn, and I'm like, who's blowing their horn? And then I looked over, and I saw the Streamlabs notification. So happy that finally worked. Are so creative uh, right. with nicknames. It's not just dramatic, it's I I dramatic or E dramatic. This is so cool how people can be creative with nicknames. Kind of like me and necktie, huh? Yeah, why necktie? Because growing up, one of my brother's friends started calling me neck because my name's Ty, right? Started calling me necktie, and actually, my brother still does. Turn right. When is the subscribers convoy going to happen? That you know, Brandon, that's a damn good question. Um. Keep right. After fifty yards, go straight. I don't know, but it I'm it does need to happen and it will happen. It's such a pain in the butt trying to get everything um, squared away. And by squared away I mean mod wise. Now question, are you meaning ATS or ETS? No, oh, ATS, good luck with that. Yeah, I think in ATS I'd have to make a complete other profile. Something is wrong here. ETS, I can use this one. Are you lost? I think we're at the right spot, aren't we? Yeah, I'm just curious, how am I supposed to back up there? Oh, just back around the building. Do you have enough room to go to the right? And then back up. Ah, this is gonna be tricky. What do you mean tricky? Come on, man. This is shit show logistics. You can do that. I need to pull up further. My question is, why isn't there a green icon? This isn't external, is it? Oh, I'm gonna be no. late. I'm gonna be late. You have green icon only if you select the, the if you have in settings that you sell always select. I've I had a green icon every other time, that's why I was wondering. Hey, there's a DAF dealer over there. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm late. I have zero minutes. Oh well. At least I won't get a reckless penalty. Yeah, Brandon, so with the mods, um back to that. Uh one could happen fairly soon in ETS. Because um, this profile that I'm in right now, that Chris and I are in, 
all I would have to do is pull out the the only paid mods in it are the graphics the JBX and the PNG everything else is base game now to do that in ATS I think I have 155 mods in my main profile I would it would be easier just to build a whole new profile for ATS which when I get to that point is probably what I'll have to do but the easiest thing to do is um, hop in the discord because that's probably where I will do those updates and then when I get to that point I'll probably post a Google Doc that has all the mods or whatever but um and if anybody's not a member of the discord and wants to be a member of the discord exclamation point discord in the chat should bring up that link if it doesn't there should be one in the description below that works because i put it for indefinite but sometimes it's not always indefinite Now Streambot's gonna make me look like an idiot. And I don't need anybody's help making me look like an idiot. I am pretty sure I set that up. Oh, I see what you're saying. says unable to accept invite okay was that that was the link in the description dear lord that was tricky are you unloaded yeah can I'm... you can you alt tab out and go to discord and put an invite link in the chat for me invite to discord right yeah just go to discord and create an invite for and then yeah, sure, sure, sure. I need to update the one in the description again. Brand or dramatic said it's not. Says it expired. I wonder how late I want to be. Um, there we go. Oh, I see what you're saying. Cause this is kind of uh. Iris says she used the link on YouTube. Maybe it's because I copied it from another description. Oh, I got it, Iris. So you used the link from the channel, like in my About section. Yeah, it is true. It is there, too. But I need to add that to my chatbot list of stuff to, to fix. All right, well, at least that one works. Brandon, I appreciate you saying that because I, I have no clue. Okay, I, I'm gonna tell you what I'm gonna do right now. Wait, that's under gameplay. Right, where's it at, where's it at? Okay, now I completely missed it, apparently. Time zones, bus scenes. Okay, is it in audio? Backup beeper. Yes, it was an audio. Holy crap. Oh, much better. 
weird still says unable to accept invite. Well, what the heck? Dramatic, um, do me a favor and just click on the... Just go to my main channel part and click on the about section and there's a link there that Iris said works. And then I will uh, get all of that crap squared away this afternoon. Oh no, I'm backed into it. Holy crap. Ty, you're in ATS reverse, not American reverse. Now what am I hitting? Am I literally hitting the back of that wall now? Okay, camera. Holy shit, Ty. Anyway, Brandon, before I got sidetracked with this, turn your wheel the opposite way. This is why I hate backing up in this view, because it's completely ass backwards. Um, Brandon, back to your comment. I appreciate that about the Discord, because sometimes I think it's a... I mean, well, no pun intended, but I think it's a complete shit show sometimes, because I set it up, and I have no clue what the hell I'm doing when it comes to Discord. I apparently yeah, have no clue what I'm doing when it comes to driving a truck either at the moment. This last uh, link I, I posted should work. I'm trying to figure out why this is such a pain in the ass to get into this freaking hole. There should be, in the background, this music from this mem uh, directed by Robert B. White. Still won't work, I think my Discord is broken. That, that is a possibility? I don't, I don't know. There are no private messages here, right? On, on YouTube. Wow. I really thought that that was going to hit the wall there, and it didn't that time. Yeah, how about we, how about we just do that? Because I'm tired of fighting with it. Late. No. Hey, at least I made money. Three euro. Three. All right, now I need to get back. Uh, hold on, Ty, Ty, do this, do this, do this. Okay, why isn't my escape key working to go back into the freaking? Do this, do this, do this. Can someone add me and send an invite through there? And let me try this right quick. Hopefully that doesn't tank the stream. I tried this last link, a dramatic. I just posted. Because apparently uh, every link is valid seven days. So I don't think I think your links in descriptions description might not work. Oh, they do. Because <laughs> um, down 
and I don't know, maybe you don't have it, but when I go to invite link, I can, um, it says expires in seven days, but then it says edit link invite. Oh, yeah, yeah, I can see that now. Okay. And I do the never. Oh, okay. No limit. Generate new link. Copy. Yeah, he got in. And I'm a day late, dollar short with mine then. So disregard that then. If you ever want to test something for a subscriber coming. Yeah, Brandon, I will. And I think what I'm going to do is uh, let me actually get back into the game here. And then what I can do is actually I did this wrong. Hold on one. Um, we can turn that up. And then we can go back to this one. Well, the easiest way would be to play without power mods. Just Steam one. Right. And yeah, that's what we'll have to do. I guess I could do this since my webcam is not in there. Then, oh, wow. That shit was bright. Um, yeah. <laughs> Let there be light. So probably what I'm going to have to do is create like a a multiplayer um, channel, I guess, for updates. Well, I can put, obviously I can put an update in the uh, announcement channel, but yes, that'll be coming. Um, Quick reminder, episode 97 is live. I'm going to let you all know that are here right now. You if don't you... have any reminders about episode 97 is live. I don't know why you're interrupting me, quite what honestly. Somehow, um, the S-I-R-I -I lady thought I was talking to her. Um, Siri. <laughs> Yeah, so 97 is not for everybody. I'm gonna let you know now because like the first 45 minutes or so are covering the mods. But I let you know that at the beginning and there's timestamps. So if you just wanna skip to the driving part, skip to the driving part and knock yourself out. Um, create a folder with all your mods, put them in Discord and people will be able to use them and join. Correct, dramatic. Yeah, that's what I need to do for the... I already have um, four ETS and ATS on Discord for the mods I'm running, but that has everything in it, the payware and everything. So I basically need to strip all the payware stuff out and then put a document up. Where are we at? We're in the Netherlands, right? What was that sound? Oh, that was you, you dropped out. Yeah, my Discord went, went crazy. Oh, your Discord went crazy. Um, yeah, ladies and gentlemen, so with that... Um, we're gonna wrap this up here. I appreciate every one of you for stopping by... ...and enjoying this with us. Um... Appreciate that, Brandon. Um, tomorrow? Yep, correct. See you tomorrow. Yes, 1 p.m. Central Standard Time, if this is your first time here. We will be doing this again. Thank you, man, and thank you, everyone, on the chat, in the chat. Yeah, and Iris, we will be continuing in your, your homeland. I don't know if that's your homeland, sorry. <laughs> uh, you could have moved there, but the country you're currently living in. Appreciate it, Clive. Yes, I look forward to it tomorrow. Same bat time, same bat channel, as it were.
Oh, don't worry, Dramatic. It's it's all good. And if you want to catch up, this is going to stay up as a video after the fact. But yeah, I'm uh, live every Saturday and Sunday, 1 p.m. Central Standard Time. Thank you, Brendan. I did my best with my poor English. No, you do better than you think you do. No, no, I know, I know how I speak. I just backed out of the convoy, and I think my my total net was negative seventy four thousand dollars or something like that. Here's an idea from Stewart. How how about going tomorrow from Netherlands to UK? Let's go, Scotland. That means I have to drive on the opposite side of the road, right? Yeah, it's the best. All right, there you go. I guess uh, Netherlands is close. Yeah. I mean, we should be a couple loads away, right? Maybe, maybe, maybe even one. Cool. Well, thanks again, ladies and gentlemen, and we will see you all tomorrow.